Right folks, good morning. This is uh, day two. We didn't actually finish off day one because we got drunk last night. Well, they were half drunk, didn't we? We had a good few drinks. Hurt, didn't we? Good meal last night and everything, but we're uh, refreshed. A little bit of rain in here and ready for a day round the valley. So we're going to meet the rest of the crew now. This is a brilliant place we're staying, by the way, at the moment. I'll tell you more about that later because we didn't get a chance last night. Um, lovely little garage space for the bikes. So we will be back here after today's ride. So I'll go and meet the rest of the crew and then we'll get on with the day. So see you in the bikes, folks. Okay, folks, so <coughs> day two at the clock tower. How are you doing, Chris? <laughs> if I said good, I'd be lying. <laughs> <laughs> so a good view of the uh, bikes for today's ride because uh, we're all split up yesterday. So all in their glory. How are you doing, team? Here we go folks, ready for the off, all ready for the off. Let's go make some noise. Open territory. We just last night. What happened is we just uh, crashed out, dumped everything off at the uh, B and B we're staying in, me and Irk, and then disappeared down to the town, down to the village. Already had a meal booked, had a few pints, got back and just crashed out. So a little bit abrupt then last night between that and this morning. But anyway, here we go. Well. There's certain places to get your milk, but right there's not one of them. Dump. View the wooded road. Wow. So, working around the other side of the reservoirs now, we've doubled back from the first road we was on before. These are some stunning roads. Look at that ahead. Did you see that road winding up into that? Man, you're not going down that one, I don't think, but that one looks a bloody good road. Regardless, I think it was on my own. I'd be so just tempted to go up that one, even though there's a dead end. Oh, looks like it's closed actually for uh, vehicular access, so bollocks to that anyway. But this one, still a great road on the valley floor, just following the river. But can't believe we've been so lucky after what the forecast said now today. We've still got dry roads, but look at that beautiful, beautiful. No idea where this road's going now, but you see winding up into the hillside. Dirt all over the road, plenty of sheep shit, proper adventure bike territory, but the 48s and the rest of the sportsters are taking it all in the stride. The only thing with it round here is very, very popular for uh, camper vans and Oh, that guy just keeps appearing taking pictures of us 
sure it's the same guy that was in the town earlier on. Aberystwyth via the mountain road. It's a ride uh, five miles that way through the Elm Valley now. Aberystwyth, Aberystwyth. We do the mountain road. That was a, an attempt at Welsh. Oh, that road up there. So we've just come from all the way over there, winding round this road, and now we're on the Aberystwyth Mountain Road. It's got bloody windy as well. Dark skies of doom. You stay there, pal. Quick stop after a blast down that road, that was good fun then until I realised I was in the air at about 115 but anyway, all there, taking a little break. Adventure bikes coming through. Straight on the mountain road, on the top of the moor, in the middle of nowhere. So I think the next stop is it Devil's Bridge we're headed. 20 mile or something, Devil's Bridge for a bit of cake and a piss. What do you mean? Well, so far we've not got pissed on, uh, we've managed to avoid the cloud of doom, the only cloud of doom is right in front of me now. Clown of doom. Cloud of doom. Cloud. 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 What is a clown? Clown of doom. <laughs> Now time to play catch up. I'd say out of all the roads so far, th this one is definitely one of my favourites. Road surface isn't too bad, there's a few bumps and whatnot, but the actual potholes are non-existent at the moment, so that's pretty good. So apart from a lot of sheep on the road, it's a damn good road, lots of bends to enjoy yourself on. in places here as well which you need waterfalls and nature trails in the three bridges nice Ferrari stick to your 20 mile an hour limits the Vale of Rydal Rydal See what we are doing.
There's some engineering for you. Hey, guess what? I just got 20 minutes of video in my pocket. Oh, well, there's some editing time for you. Look at that. How things used to be built. So, a quick stop at the two tea rooms, the Vale of Rydal Railway, and then back now, back to starting up for some more fantastic riding around some of these great roads. So, we'll see you back on the bikes, folks. This is all for bikes here at Devil's Bridge. From the village into the sunshine into the little valley roads now look at these brilliant little b roads heading towards wherever we don't care but this is uh, what riding's all about in the blue sky mountains and little back roads and the sound of all these sportsters in front and behind although got nothing behind me at the moment so i don't know where the rest of the pack is but come out of that and look at this we've got coming into a head brilliant See, they'll catch up. But yeah, what a road this is. And another thing as well is what I found is all these back roads. It's the same as what I find in Scotland. All these little roads have been resurfaced, so the condition of them is fantastic for riding. You don't have to worry about half the time that missing and potholes anywhere. Look at that view. Wow. And is that the road ahead? <laughs> oh my god. What a road. The scenery around here just goes on and on. It's fantastic. But that road, that's special. The whole of that so far to here, well worth doing. Well worth it. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Shit. Ride it down. Right. Fuck. Fuck. Kyle's off. Shit.
Go, 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 go sit down on the banking. Go and sort yourself out. Go sit down. I got back wheels. You okay, mate? Um, we get down on this fork. Mine's in the way. I'm trying. <laughs> Could have been worse, you could have been all the way down the bottom of there. Yeah. <sighs> right, go and sit down, go and sit down. So it just goes to show you how one minute, you know, everyone's having a load of fun. <laughs> and then you come round the bend and one of you your mates is on the road but fortunately he's fine we just just have to bend a couple of levers straight on the bike he's uh, his foot's hurting a bit but he's uh, he's, he's rideable so he's all right that's the main thing and uh, fortunately not much damage to the bike either so we just come around the around the bend said he hit i think he hit neutral or something like that or hit the brake and the brake locked up i don't know if there's any shit but that's the problem is, is you're too busy, you're taking in the scenery around here you just cannot take your eyes off the road for a minute Shit happens, but it's alright and we're back as a group, so that's the second one this this weekend now Right, playing catch up again. <coughs> this bottom part of the road, I've really enjoyed this. These roads are fantastic. Again, they do remind me of some of the borders roads, but surfacing is just so good. It's a little bit of loose stone on some of the corners you just gotta watch out for, but which obviously has caught a couple of riders out, but apart from that, Today's riding has just been fantastic. And we're still not done. So coming off the top of that road now, looking down into that valley. Again, it's one of those where you just turn a corner and you think, wow, these roads have just go on for miles. Look at that. <laughs> folks so this is uh, Sunday morning now so from Friday morning all the way to Sunday we've had a brilliant weekend here in Wales and uh, I've split from the pack now we've just said our goodbyes had a brilliant weekend with everyone so I'm just on the way back now I'm on the A470 heading to the 483 and getting myself home it's gonna be a beautiful day today blue skies gonna be the best day out of the weekend typical but it's always the day that you're coming home for a ride so we got off Bit of beautiful scenery still to come before I get back down with the main drag, but hope you've enjoyed watching uh, this little mini series in Wales. Like I said, if it's your first time watching that come out, oh please do hit the subscribe button. Please like, comment, share video. All helps to build the channel. Uh, but look out soon for the mega adventure coming up at the end of uh, August. 
just one to look forward to as well as everything else that's coming in between I'll be back on the 48 next week depending when I get this vlog out uh, for Sports of Sickness big one so back out on the 48 on the Sportster for those that be interested in the sports and stuff on the channel but apart from that we'll see you soon but for now Alcamoto signing out thanks for coming on for the ride folks we'll see you later